everyone. Uh, I'm gonna try and answer a question that I have, I guess the majority of you have also, is what is the battery capacity? Uh, you see here there's a rated, a straight, um, non-dotted uh, gray line. That's what they rate, that's what cur currently what I achieved on the last 10 kilometers. So I'm gonna try and drive a bit pretty badly, heat up the car to increase the consumption to try and match these two lines. So once I get the value of what's rated, uh, we can do the back calculation based on the website estimation. And also I'll try and get this projected here and do the ratio for the percentage, okay? So let's go for some driving. I'm gonna try and make this as a bad driving as I can for fuel consumption or <laughs> energy consumption. Here we go. There we go, bingo, 135, that's it, that's the number, there you go, record everything. So here on top you can see the screenshot of the moment uh, the dotted line overlaps the gray line, <coughs> being the dotted the one the vehicle is achieving and the gray is the one that uh, the vehicle is rated for. So just doing a simple uh, regression here. Uh, at 100%, it would yield 395.9 kilometers. Uh, with that rate of consumption, it'll, it gives it the battery's 53 kilowatt hour. Now, if we use the website uh, on the bottom image uh, for the rated 4 to 3 kilometers, and again, using the uh, consumption as uh, detailed above, then the battery would have 57.1 kilowatt hour. Uh, I cannot precise if my battery needs some calibration here. Why isn't isn't it achieving the 4 to 3 rating? Uh, but it's definitely somewhere between 53 and 57. Um, the the full uh, capacity of this battery or the available capacity. Okay, hope you enjoyed. Give a like, subscribe, and uh, use my referral code if you can. Take care. Bye.